Hey, hey guys, I'm here with a flip through, and not just one finished flip through, but two. Yes, we have a pick a stick, and then of course my Jane Davenport we finally finished. So let's get Sharon and flip it, right? Um, I actually, I like to see my covers when I use things that are not a art journal. Um, <laughs> I like the look of it. So, and I started on 8-24-17, and I finished on 12-15-19. Uh, this one actually did take a couple years. My first pick-a-stick was extremely fat. Um, if I'll try to remember to put up there, let me write a note to myself. Um, we'll try here. Okay, and what is a pick a stick if you're just joining and you're going, what is it? What is it? It is exactly that we have. Um, I have pick a stick. I have my own sticks and we do blind draws. We pick 10 of them one at a time and you arch them at, at a time. You can also pick all of them at once and then do them. I you normally don't do them that way. Um, I find it the challenge of doing them one at a time. So some well, the, you're not going to get a lot of holy moly pretty uh, pick a sticks. It's not what pick a stick was for. A pick a stick for me was for me to get comfortable with my supplies, have fun, loosen up, go with the flow. Um, it will do all that. See, I like that one. It's super cute. Let's see here. Reuse part of a greeting card. It was the the Nama or Alpaca, whichever. Add paint with a credit card or card. Write random words in at least three places. And see, some of these you won't even be able to see because they're underneath the layers. So use your fingers, add squares, paint with string, something that starts with your first initial. So see, uh, could have been clouds, is probably what it was. This is so long ago, guys, I can't remember. Doodle the first image that comes to mind, use a comb, add flowers. Sorry about that, guys. He comes in, dog barks. <laughs> Use a comb, add flowers on the page. So that's just a example. I have all kinds of pick a sticks. If you're if you like them, I have a whole um, list of them, and you can go back and see some of my more my when I was a but a young lad. <laughs> my younger uh, pick a sticks. Um, I would say I do get do get better with with doing them. Um, that's fun. That's pretty. I like that. And this one, um, Nitty in our group at Art It Out um, did a, a pick a stick, and I did her picks. Blackout poetry. And sometimes you can get a pretty cool um, pick that you wouldn't think was a pick a stick. Yeah, I like this one. It's weird and fun. I really like this one. Love, hope. Mm, now and again, I have yielded to the temptation that will fascinate and please. <laughs> oh. Wow. That one. See, add beads. See, these are just little seed beads. They work good on gluing. And got some of that. Oh, man, we had a lot going on there, didn't we? I'm assuming it write random words in at three places. You can kind of see in the background. Add random letters. 
glue down string or ribbon or some sort. Cut out letters for a ransom look. Use nature. I use nature. What did I do? I don't remember how I use nature on this one. Add white paint. Stamp into wet gesso, which is these. Add beads. Draw a face. And tissue paper, at least three spots. So I used. I really like this one with the. Oh, I like it. I love how she turned out. At the very end, it was like the last one was like add a monster. And I loved how this page turned. So it was literally just throwing a monster on. Had no rhyme or reason to go with it. Be sure this was a really pretty one that went really nicely. It flowed beautifully. We have a choice. Keep some room in your heart for unimaginable. Live the truth, be kind to you, and break the rules. Oh, this is one of the first I put in at this one. That was at a tag. I love how this turned out. That was really fun and pretty. A quirky one. So, oh, I like this one. It's got lots of texture. That was a total mess. Oh, I remember just being so frustrated with that one. Out it out. See, what did I write? Being alone urged me to uplift the heavy lids of my eyes. It was dark, all dark. Dark, all dark. The intense, utter relentlessness of the night. I shriek, no voice. And at every elaborate inspiration to cry aloud. That's kind of, it doesn't make much sense, but <laughs> blackout portrait doesn't necessarily have to. Oh, she's an ugly girl. <laughs> Friendships are like chocolate chips in the cookie of life. Some fun here. And the last one. I did this in a live. So I know that one is, if you go under the live and you'll see it. So there we go. There is the little pick a stick I finished. I'm going to have to figure out what I'm going to do for my next one. I always like to have a pick a stick book. Um, and I like to use either magazines or I have a bunch of these travel journal. Oklahoma's guides are awesome and they work awesome. They're thick. And you can go online and get them for free, actually. All right, next is my Jane Davenport. I'm going to bring you guys in a little bit closer for you can see her. Mostly in here is a lot of the, um, when we did, oh, what is it called? Um, the one, the one challenge we did in the group, I just, I'm having a brain fart here. Sorry, guys. I can't think of the darn name. I'm trying to get this here. Go, go. She waits for me. She's like a damn kid, the dog is. Waits for me to get arting and talking, and then she gets underneath my feet and plays around. Oh, it drives me crazy. All right. We started at 522, and we ended it yesterday, which was 19th. All right. And with this journal, do you know how many journals I have completed this year? I counted them up. I went back through my thing. You know how many this one makes? Ten. Ten journals. I completed ten journals this year. How freaking cool is that? 
Um, and it wasn't that, you know, I specifically put out, oh, I'm going to finish these. I got, I, I art every day, and sometimes I art several times a day. They're easy to fill if you art every day, guys. I just really love this one. Uh, I use a lot of watercolor. Oh, it was the art bag, bag art challenge. That's what it was. You had to put everything in the gallon Ziploc bag, what you could fit in there. Closed was what you had to use. Um, it was hopefully for the month. I didn't quite make it to the month. I think I made 22. 22? I think is what I made, and I was just, I needed to move on, so. <laughs> but I still call it a success. It was fun, and I will definitely do it again. This is just, oh, I was just, did not happen the way I wanted it to. I did this, like, it was soon after I started, so. Do more than exist. Shark, no. We'll take that away then. Alright. Watercolor. That is the stamp that I hand carved. Um, it's actually for sale in my shop. Just some fun. A lot of these are very abstract. No rhyme or reason, which is me. <laughs> Don't test my waters. You won't know how to swim. Two separate ones. I do not, as you see, some of them I do both sides, but a majority of them I don't. Just some art one night, needing to art it out. And I like to write down in the background feelings, things that pop in my mind, whatever, I get it on the paper. Because it makes me happy, that's why. This is actually, for you to know, I love the little guy I have hanging off, but it's actually tissue paper that I glued on here. In it together. These are embossed. Smorgish Borg of Marks. Very pretty. There's some glitter, shimmer. Shimmer. I'm not going to say glitter. It's shimmery. <laughs> hmm. Very pretty. That was a fun one. I did not see... Well, none of these I see how they... Uh, you know, I sit down I art, guys. I do not... 90% of the time, do not have the slightest inkling of where I'm going. And we're going to go 98% of the time, not 90. <laughs> Some tape that makes... Masking tape is a great one to use for texture. No journey is too great if you find what you seek. That is actually upside down. I wanted it the other way. See? But you wouldn't have known that if I didn't say nothing. So much in this on this one to look at and to see, and I just really like it. Attitude is everything. Joy is the feeling that we have touched the hem of something far beyond ourselves. She is super thick. She's got a lot on her. Because I'm like, God, is that more than one page? Hello, my darling. Be brave in everything. This was actually the first page I did in here testing out how her Jane Davenport's. Uh, <laughs> this is actually her. Canvas journal is what it's called. Six by nine. Um, canvas. Yeah. Name Santa. I hope you guys can see the glitter that kind of comes on there. 
I see a woman dancing. I wrote, be you, be free, be bold, be you, be free. <laughs> Just be you. Have fun. Go with it. I really like how this one turned out. I thought it was going to, it was going towards a, a ick, but it turned out to be a yay. Just some fun. Stand tall like the tree. Dig deep like the tree. And change like the tree. Just some willy nilly fun on that one. Once the game is over, the king and the pawn go back into the same box. What seems ordinary is often extraordinary. I use that one a lot. It seems. Oh, I really enjoy that one. I really enjoy this one. It's very moving in my opinion. Lots of depth. <laughs> oh, spirit merchant, return wonders a good night work. This guy's been disemboweled and he's like floating down the, the river. Very bad day. And I will tell you, there was probably... If you can see the writing, the words here. I took watercolor and I took the smallest brush I could. And literally, layer upon layer, I dip in, I'd write words. Dip in, write words. Well, as you can see, it literally just blends out, blends out. So it's layers and layers and layers of my words and journaling. And yes, it. I don't think it looks all that pretty. It's a lot of depth, and for me, I got rid of a lot. I arted it out on this one, guys. And, yeah, I like it because of it. Always take the scenic route. I say that, but I wouldn't do it. <laughs> so I'm kind of went everywhere, too. Oh, I enjoyed that one. We did that one in... It was Sunday Share, just this last Sunday. I think it was in the group, I'm pretty sure. Um, I did a live this last Sunday in YouTube land and Facebook land. I did not get to Instagram land, but that's all right. I thought two out of three, I enjoyed it. What lies behind you and what lies in front of you... Tales in comparison to what lies inside of you. And this is the last one I did just yesterday. There is a video for it. If you haven't caught it, it's called um, Pick Your Colors or Color Pick Random. Pick a six color, something like that. It is not what we have in life, but who we have in life that matters. I will say this. I wish I wouldn't have wrote in my hand. Which I usually say after I do. But at the time it told me. my I went with it. And um, yeah. I don't like my handwriting. I never like my handwriting on there. Like that. Now in the background type of things. I love you know. I love the in the background type of writing. But bold black like that. It just throws me off. All I can do is look at those words. Instead I see the page. For what it is. So. That's my own problem. <laughs> so there we go. And on completion, if you're asking why do I not do this one or that first one, this is why they kind of glue them. They glue them really high. So if you're going to do it, you're use this is not good arty paper anyways. Um, it just, it doesn't work out very well. Same thing for the first one. It kind of sticks to it. So there we go. That is number 10. 10 journals, guys. I completed 10 journals. I am just, I know I did a lot. Um, 
this year, and I am just thrilled. I actually have, I think, one more over there that's almost finished. Um, or it has quite a few left. I'm not for sure, but yay! If you want to see all those ten, I do do flipthers. I will try to put it over there. I have playlist, and it's for flipthers. Uh, make sure you check it out if you uh, are new, especially if you can see past work, or if you're wanting just some inspiration. Those are great to watch, to look at too, because you can see what I do, and maybe something would inspire you, whether some color choices or maybe a shape or a technique. Um, flip through videos are great for that. Thank you for being a part of this, guys. Um, I, I'm super excited. Happiness to you. Go make a mess. And what are you going to do? Art it out. Bye, guys.